in um, the items that pop adding and you can comment and she will answer your questions. Now to the left hand side, you will have icons that will pop up throughout. And these are the pieces that you can shop and purchase as we talk about them. To the bottom, you will see a handbag icon. And this is where you can shop the full range from today's fabulous drop. And um, yes, yeah, so as previously mentioned, if you have any questions, just leave um, a mention in the comment box below and I can definitely help and assist you as we go along. So we have an array of items from jewellery, bags, shoes. We're going all out today. And I wanted to start off with, I would call this bag a classic from the house of Givenchy. So this is the Givenchy Pandora bag. Now, if you are aware of this style, these have been um, remodernized in many different ways. So currently they are still produced by Givenchy, but with a top handle and they retail for around 1,300. Now the Pandora bag actually came out in the fall of 2007. So has been around for a long time. So you can call it a classic. Now, this is one of those pieces that is more of a slouchier feel. It's definitely a daytime kind of vibe and um, you can wear it as a crossbody. Now, I am a big fan of a small crossbody bag, but practical, so you can fit a lot of items in it. It's got that black distress level with the silver toned hardware, so really durable, really easy to match and great for every day. Now, this one is priced at £295. How incredible is that? As I mentioned, these retail for £1,300. I actually can't believe that, Rachel. It's that, that greatly priced. Um, condition, again, very, very good. Um, little to no signs of wear. And it has a very nice, clean interior to it. Um, another classic. Let's talk about the Gucci Micro Boston bag. Now, these Boston bags... Um, came out in the 70s so again have been around for a long long time and this is in that cute little nano style super on trend everybody is loving the nano bags at the moment now it's got that coated canvas to it so if you can slightly see it's got a slight slight sheen to it and that's it now for out of the bag you have that gg monogram logo so super iconic um this bag is just a top handle if you were wondering um, but you could potentially buy kind of another strap, wear it diagonally and wear it as a crossbody, but you could probably purchase this separately. Now, again, the condition is beautiful. It's got that top zip closure. So if you're somebody like me that likes to keep their items nice and safe, um, you can just zip the top closure to it. And then again, a very clean interior. Considering the size, the size of it is quite spacious. I think you could just about get your phone inside. Just, mm, could you? Wow. Uh, I'm double guessing myself oh, now. Um, this is an iPhone, yes, so you can. This is an iPhone 8, just about get your phone in. So for me, it's a win-win. Um, yeah, but these have been around since the 70s and again have been one of those pieces that have just been remodernized time after time. But again, it's still such a modern and sought after piece. Now, this is on our website for £240. I think it's adorable. This would also make a great little uh, Christmas stocking filler. We were playing Christmas music today in the yeah. showroom. Hi. I'm not a fan of playing Christmas music in yeah. November, but... We have some people, as in Rachel in the corner, who loves to play Christmas music. So yes, great Christmas fitting. Um, Louis Vuitton. So Louis Vuitton, you cannot go wrong. It's that classic monogram print, super iconic, super easy to wear and pair. Now, this is a... So it is a vintage. It shows those light signs of wear throughout but for me this is perfect if you just want to slip in your laptop it can fit an ipad or you can just use it as it probably was traditionally used as a document holder but i love this for that kind of really easy size clutch back coated canvas again so it has that sheen to it which i think gives it that little bit more of a luxurious feel to it and the hardware has small signs of tarnishing but it is a vintage, so I think this just adds so much character to the piece. So whilst we're on Louis Vuitton, I thought I would show you this Louis Vuitton bucket style bag. Now, for me, a bucket style bag 
is such a cool kind of shape. It still is really wearable, which we want from a larger daily bag, but it's got that more unique twist to it, which I absolutely love. So again, a vintage, you know we love vintage pieces over here at Luxury Promise. It's got that monogram print throughout. So I think this is really great if you're somebody that just likes to open their bag really conveniently. It's got that two um, handles and then also don't worry about if you're a taller person or a petite person, you can definitely adjust the handles and wear it. So this is a bag that is one fit, one size fits all. Um, and yeah, it just fits really comfortably over the shoulder. Now, because it is a vintage, it is showing darkening to the handles but for me i think this is so special and again it just adds that real character to the bag it's got some watermarks to the base here but this is very normal when it comes to vintage louis vuitton pieces now this one is prized let me get the price for you 495. wow it's 495 pounds so again a really really good price for a bag that's super practical but has that kind of unique twist to it um we have let's move on to some shoes because it's always nice to show you an array of different items now these are a real special pair of shoes these are jimmy choo they remind me of kind of dorothy style shoes incredibly sparkly very special and they are a size 37 now they have been worn they've got slight wear to the soles but the general body to the shoes are very good condition so have a look at those, that sparkling rainbow kind of vibe. Now, if you are somebody that is getting ready for the Christmas party season, I would say these are a great alternative if you're a person that don't, doesn't really like to wear high heels on a night out. You still have that elegance, you still have that very specialness. When it comes to a pair of shoes you want for a special event, but you've got that nice, easy heel for a comfortable wear. You'll be laughing when everybody on the dance floor, they have the, their feet are hurting and you're like, I still look glamorous, but my feet are still in, feeling great. And we have another pair, which I say, think you could use for pretty much the same occasion. And it's these Louboutins. Now you can't go wrong with a classic red sole, can you? They're very iconic. These are in a patent leather with that sweet little bow detailing to the front. These are a 36.5. Louboutins, I, especially flats, I think they're very much true to size. Um, and again, the overall body is very nice and clean. These would actually work for more occasions. You definitely could wear these for work. They would look great with a nice tailored pair of trousers. Um, but then they would work also for an event in the evening if you wanted them for that because that because they are patent. For me, patent does feel that little bit more evening-like as well. So these are a great multi-purpose shoe with that brilliant red sole to them, what we love from a Bhutan shoe. Um, and then we have a high amount of requests for Prada nylon pieces just because they are one of the most on-trend pieces at the moment. As we all know, Prada have reintroduced the um, 2005 re-edition bag. So these are great at the moment, especially when we can get them in vintage, in a great condition, at a great price. Now this is the pochette style. So again, still feels very modern. Um, and Prada still produce the same style. This is in a gorgeous kind of aubergine purple but it's got that metallic feel to it it's got that prada logo to the front that we want now i am wearing quite a thick jumper today but can it um, can it fit just about over the shoulder if you're wearing a t-shirt say in the in the summer or, um wrist kind of bag but this is in that nylon fabric very beautiful color great for all seasons um and really great to wear day and evening but if you were someone that was after something a little bit more casual and more of a daily wear bag then this prada satchel again it's in that purple color but more of a lighter i'd call this like a mermaid purple it's got that kind of shine metallic feel to it and this is that classic now this is in a size small so yeah daily anything but it will fit in just about what you need for your daily activities again condition wise are very very beautiful little to no signs of wear to the exterior and the interior let me check this for you we like to give a good re condition report 
and the interior again is nice and clean and it's got that prada logo lining to the interior which they still do do and yeah really good and the strap is adjustable as well we also have oh i love it when winnie buys in jewelry she buys in the best jewelry so this is a piece of jewelry it is 450 pounds and it's that chanel um plaque detailing now it's the brooch so it's got the traditional brooch clasp to the back now what i love about brooches is and sabrina's really great at actually doing this is you can wear a simple zara outfit a zara blazer you stick on that statement chanel brooch and it just makes everything look that's that much more expensive now because it is a vintage it's in that 24 karat gold gilding hardware it's got the chanel logo which we all love and these can be worn in multiple ways so i i love i saw a lady the other day wearing it with a scarf so she she wrapped it around she pinned the little brooch to the scarf and again it probably was just a zara scarf but it just made it look so so expensive so this comes with its tag as you can see here and then also its box so really special piece and great price at 450 pounds brooches now and they're not even um gilded gold they retail now for about 1500 from chanel so a real great saving and again it's got that real modern feel to it um, we actually have quite a bit of jewellery today. Now, these, for me, I love a statement earring. I think it's something where if you're going on an evening out, you can just wear a little black dress and then this just glams up the whole outfit. So again, these are Chanel, but a bit more... They're, they're understated in regards to they're not logoed with Chanel, but they are a statement all at the same time. So it's got that big pearl drop detailing here. They are a clip-on because they... They are from more of a vintage piece but it's great as well if you like to make 24 karat gold gilding but then you've got the silver tone to um the middle and it's got kind of that 3d effect to it which i really really like and just that very iconic pearl drop detailing from chanel now these do not come with their box but there's no tarnishing to the hardware at all and they're just a very glamorous piece to add to your wardrobe and then Let's do more of a modern piece, actually. So then we have um, a Chanel necklace, which is more of a modern piece. I believe this was from like the 2019 collection. How cute is that? I love Chanel. Yes, we love Chanel. Who doesn't? Um, so again, to, to it. Um, let's see the length of it. So I believe this is just a very easy to wear length. So look so it fits probably around here now one of these necklaces are just one of those great pieces if you want to wear um kind of day and evening it works well for all occasions and it's just very pretty it comes with its box it's got that love heart detailing and i love i think this is adorable i really really love this piece um we've got more jewelry but i'm going to move on to some bags we'll mix it up today um let's do some gucci we haven't had this style of gucci bag in for a while so this gucci bag comes in many different sizes this is the smaller size which again is great for day and evening it's in that beautiful blue tone so great for all seasons and then it's got that gucci logo to the front now i must point out it does show light signs of use to the interior but obviously nothing too major for me, when it comes to buying a pre-loved bag, I don't really mind if the interior has a bit of marking to it anyway, especially if it's a piece that you're going to use more daily because you know you're going to be putting your makeup inside anyway. Um, but yeah, there's, it's not that bad really at all. And then the corners are nice and clean. If you know me, you know that I love a versatile bag it in many different ways so you can wear it casually as a crossbody and then just as a top handle as i previously was wearing it this one is on our website 395 pounds and i actually brought this bag in i've just realized so this is one of my buy-ins um and then it's got that tag as well which i love and um can that come there no it's just and say they love this color because it's great for all seasons um, and then another piece that's in that kind of this this feels like a grain saffiano lever. That's the only way I can compare it. And then we've got this Prada bag. 
again how cool is that so it's almost got a trapez style to it so it's got the wing detailings to the side i'm a fan of pink i love pink for all seasons it brightens up your day and makes you happy um and this is a prada classic tote style bag now favorite part to this bag guys is the shoulder length just look how comfortable that is so it's a great length you know you can fit a lot in it it's got very sturdy leather handles which i absolutely love and it's super comfortable and then you can just fit in all your items um i don't think it will fit a laptop in though just looking at it or do you it think it will though. the bottom is so big yeah so because it's got that trapez wing style to it it does make the base look a bit more narrow than what it is but once you open it you can wear it wider without it and it like widens it a little bit and then you can also see if you can do this if you can push it in probably not because it's been trained like that but you can make it a little bit more sloucher as well if that's something you want to do again the condition's beautiful um light signs of wear to the corners but this is ex expected with a pre-loved tote style bag because we want to wear this um but yeah really easy to wear and great for daily use uh shall we do a bit of louis vuitton we love a bit of louis vuitton so i'm going to move on to louis vuitton now this is a real throwback for me this really reminds me of kind of the paris hilton era when that whole denim style was seen everywhere now for me this still is a very massive trend i love the denim style now let's talk about this bag and how cool and versatile it is so number one it's in pink one of my favorite colors as you can see i've just um flapped it over so you can wear it more as like a flap envelope clutch style bag which again i absolutely love you can wear it as a top satchel bag so how perfect is that that's great for daily use so you've literally gone from evening to day to Oh, don't, you can probably do it as a crossbody, but I'm not. To picking the kids up from school. How easy is that? So we've got three bags for one over here. So it's in that denim fabric. Again, really durable. Now the condition of this is, for the age of it, is absolutely brilliant. Um, the leather's absolutely pristine. And then it's got light, light signs of wear to the denim. And then another denim piece we have is this Louis Vuitton here. It's in, I think this is more of a grey, grey blue tone. Um, and then this is just a really easy everyday kind of satchel bag. Um, definitely can fit a laptop inside of this. So I would personally use this as a work bag. Um, and yeah, the interior is a very spacious, very clean. Um, so really practical. This is actually a bag that you would probably have for a lifetime it will never date it's one of those pieces that will just go with absolutely anything also if you're in if you're part of our live at the moment if you have any questions or you want to see anything you can just let us know daily we do drops and they drop on our website at 10 30 so this is where you can see them straight away and then we normally do our lives with the pieces that haven't sold um but we still have some really great pieces um let's move on to jewelry again so we've seen brooches, we've seen earrings. Now I'm going to show you this very special Chanel bracelet. Now for me, this so this is £595. It's got kind of like this mesh detailing to it. So it, it's very fluid is the word that I would use for it. Although it looks really chunky, it's quite a fluid piece. Now this doesn't have a clasp to it. It basically is, it just slides over your wrist really easy to wear throughout you have the cc logos which i absolutely love now for me i love silver tone jewelry people have their preference but i love silver um and again just really easy like useful to have you can wear it daytime this look really cool with kind of um a leather jacket and an all black outfit or you can just wear it as that statement piece in in the evening with a nice pretty dress 595 pounds guys as you all know chanel jewelry is so much more expensive than this a bracelet from chanel again would cost you around a thousand pounds plus more so great savings there's no sign of tarnishing and this is a very unique and different and then oh i love these earrings so these are it chanel earrings again 
Now for me, I love an understated earring. So these have kind of a half hexagon kind of look to them actually. So although these are a more older piece, they do feel very much on trend because it's that half cuff earring that everybody's loving at the moment. It is a yes. I was just going to say the half hexagon and triangle, but... Oh, half... I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, no, Is I'm it half hexagon? How, how many sides does the shape have? I'm trying oh, to you think. you right. I just... Yeah. Works in funny ways. I think it's like a half hexagon. Uh, um, But it's that very on-trend cuff style earring. Um, and I like it when they're chunky, but they're small. So again, you can wear them for many different occasions. Today, we have items that are very, very useful, which is always great um and they come with their box and their sleeve as you can see here so we'll make a great christmas present as well because when when it comes to christmas we do want to give them potentially in the box and so on but yeah really really nice um we have over here move on to a different brand so we have a chloe fay bag now these again are super on trend. Every I remember when these came out. I remember everyone was like, "I want this Chloe bag. Have you seen it?" And there was one year at Fashion Week that everybody was wearing this bag. Um, this is in a very easy tone of like taupey color. So for me, again, a great bag for all seasons. Comfortable, easy to wear. Um, it's got that gold toned hardware as well, which I think makes it very special against the the more neutral taupe background. It just brings it to life a little bit more and then you've got this really fun kind of um hook detailing so you can keep your items secure um but then I'm trying to undo it or undo it but this basically you undo this part and then it's got that flap closure so it has got light signs of wear to the suede because suede is it can be hard to look after you do have to kind of look after it and make sure you don't get any water on it but then it's got that very um smooth um calf lever to the base love this adjustable strap um if you were somebody that were af was after louis vuitton but you're more of a fan of more of an understated piece um we have this epi lever now, I love epi leather because you don't really come across it that much anymore. Again, it's in that gorgeous aubergine purple colour um, and the perfect piece to wear daily. For me, Louis Vuitton is one of the most popular brands that you, you almost see a lot of people wearing. So I like to get something a little bit different. Um, and this definitely is that. It's got a canvas interior with the epi leather to the exterior light signs of wear to the corners but not too noticeable at all and it's just that really easy um um handheld bag which i'm loving at the moment i think many more people now are wearing their bags as handheld um we still love a crossbody but i think we're starting to get um the gist of that and um yeah amazing can so can you hold it up a little please? yeah sorry there you go I keep, because you don't realise, because the comments do cover it. So, um, there you go. Beautiful colour, that epi leather to it and so on. And it's got that padlock detailing there. So, I absolutely love that. Um, we've shown you most of the day. Let's finish off with this Prada bag. Do the ton here. Yes, that, I like that. Do you like that, I Rachel? Like that. Let's finish off this here. It was, it was hiding at the bottom. Yeah. So um, let's do an unboxing. So we've got a Louis Vuitton um, wallet agenda kind of style to it. And it's got that Damier print to it in that coated canvas. Now these are a no brainer. These are just so handy to have in your wardrobe. You can fit documents in it. You can fit your passport holders in it. Um, it's got card compartments, wallet compartments. Now, again, condition-wise, light signs of wear to the corners, tiny, tiny signs of wear, um, but the overall interior is absolutely beautiful. Now, this is £275. Now, actually, I went into Louis Vuitton the other day um, just to check some bits out, and these agendas now retail for nearly £600. So, buy one pre-loved. Um, so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Tomorrow is Team Top Picks. So, we have created some pieces that we love from this week. And Grace will be conducting that. Um, live, if we have to
discuss discuss today um but yeah so we'll see you tomorrow and have a really good day and thank you so much for joining